I was the interim chief financial officer for a startup uh, company um, that was attempting to create a, a new online uh, business model around the restaurant ordering and takeout business. Well, I had worked with Scorpion previously uh, on another uh, company and uh, actually had many years of experience working uh, with Walter and, and other members of the Scorpion team. And so I had a, a really good uh, experience in, in that case. And so I, uh, I was very comfortable recommending uh, them for this project uh, you know, um, that was different, but certainly I, I knew was uh, well within the uh, uh, capabilities that, that, they, that they had. The uh, primary problem that uh, we were facing uh, at, uh, at the time that uh, I recommend Scorpion uh, uh, be brought uh, into uh, the process was that there was a uh, proprietary piece of software that had been written uh, that the company uh, had no control over because they had not made the proper um, arrangements to have access to their own software. It was, it, it was sort of being held uh, for ransom by a, another IT developer and uh, the software wasn't working the way it was designed to work. Uh, there was a financial dispute uh, for a very large amount of money, a six-figure uh, dollar amount uh, that the other developer was uh, claiming to be owed before he would release the source code. Uh, and you had an early-stage company that was having problems uh, securing additional financing uh, because uh, they couldn't prove that their software worked and they didn't have control over the software. Uh, yeah. What Scorpion uh, first did when they came in was to do an assessment of all of the issues uh, that were faced uh, by the client and then um, uh, a, a plan or a strategy uh, for moving forward was developed uh, and then uh, on a step-by-step -step basis then uh, the, uh, the plan was executed and what resulted was that ultimately the uh, software uh, was, uh, was, was able to be uh, uh, reviewed and uh, an assessment of the software was done. Uh, Scorpion was instrumental in um, participating in negotiations with the other developer uh, which were stalled and at an impasse previously so that uh, the developer uh, would give uh, access to the code uh, to the Scorpion people and uh, then, uh, behind the scenes, uh, Scorpion was able to come up with some creative ways of working around some of the difficulties that had been encountered so that the uh, software became usable for the client, uh, even though uh, some of the financial uh, dispute uh, you know, areas were, were not fully resolved. That was something that the client uh, needed, needed to resolve, uh, you know, with the third party. But meanwhile, it took the uh, element of the code being held for ransom out of that picture and made it so that the business could get off of this sort of holding pattern they were in and move forward in a positive direction. Well, one of the things that I think is most unique about Scorpion is that they have um, a more action-oriented and results-oriented sort of approach. And you have a very uh, technologically advanced and uh, uh, sort of savvy and business experienced uh, sort of uh, people that are leading your project, uh, as well as the fact that uh, you have people that uh, are willing to roll up their sleeves and actually uh, sit there and, and be a part of the team uh, with uh, the uh, whatever management uh, uh, people are involved on the side of the client. Uh, working with a company like Scorpion can really um, uh, benefit an early stage company from the standpoint of 
adding a level of expertise uh, at a hands-on level that uh, early stage companies just usually do not have because an entrepreneur is more focused on trying to come up with the idea for the business and really not uh, be in a position to uh, execute the, the um, uh, nuts and bolts strategies that are necessary a lot of the time to uh, make into a reality you know what might be great ideas but uh, have a lot of uh, execution uh, that is going to be necessary to make them work and uh, that's something that uh, I again I, I haven't had a, I haven't seen anybody else that can do it quite like the, the people at Scorpion can um, I've always had a really good uh, working relationship with the people at Scorpion uh, I have found that uh, they are people that you can call night or day uh, they are uh, working around the clock like you are. They're uh, pulling in the same direction as you are. They have common goals and they feel like their success is your success and vice versa. Uh, uh, you know, there is no uh, limitation in terms of uh, having access to you know, the top people and uh, whatever resources are needed to you know, uh, meet deadlines or accomplish goals uh, that have been established by the company, you know, they're there to make it work. And uh, I feel like that's really uh, something that uh, is important to me uh, and, and I think is important to anybody that is trying to launch a business or is trying to achieve uh, some sort of milestones or meet goals or deadlines that they might have. Uh, you, you got to know that the people that you're working with are uh, just as dedicated uh, to making that happen as you are. And I have found that that's, that's been the case consistently with Scorpion. I always found that um, when we had some tight timelines and when we were trying to uh, make things happen, uh, on a really uh, uh, tight schedule or when we were trying to accelerate the progress on a particular project we were working on, uh, the folks at Scorpion uh, were able to marshal the resources and work the extra hours or you know, add extra people to the project, do what was necessary to really meet our needs and, and help us accomplish our goals. Uh, one of the things that uh, is essential a lot of the time uh, with an early stage company is that uh, they have to show results to their investors, they have to uh, meet uh, uh, short term goals uh, in order to uh, provide the incentive for new money to come in or for the uh, or to attract new clients uh, and so uh, it, it is often um, paramount that uh, you can't let deadlines slip and you can't uh, come up with excuses for why things don't work uh, uh, that need to work. And uh, I feel like uh, I always had good experience with Scorpion helping me get that done and uh, that's really one of their strong suits.